lot worse getting shot. You know, and you never know nowadays. A Little Rock man grateful tonight after being robbed at gunpoint at an ATM. And he's sharing his story to warn others, but also hoping someone knows something and will speak up. Our Alexis Wainwright spoke exclusively to him and joins us live on South Broadway where the incident all went down. Alexis. Well, Donna and Kevin, this is a very busy area. A lot of constant traffic here behind me. And when you take a look right over here, you can see the bank is right next door to that street. Tonight, the victim says the suspects are bold for doing something like this. I was extremely shocked. 57 year old John Kate still can't believe what happened to him. Everything was good, and then I ran out of cigarettes, of all things, and walked down there right about dusk or dark. Kate says when he went to Simmons Bank to withdraw some money, he looked to the left and saw one man holding a black revolver. He looked to the right and saw another man holding a handgun. He looked behind him and saw a man sitting in a driver's seat of a dark SUV with a dent on the side. One of them said, give me your money, white boy, or whatever. And I turned around and said, look here, man. Guns aren't necessary. I'll give you money. Kate gave in to their demands, withdrawing $600 from his account. He believes the suspects have done this before because they knew to stand in the blind spots of the security cameras. They had a mask on like this, but everything else was covered up. They're pretty smart about this because they ain't on camera. Kate is hoping what happened to him will remind people to stay vigilant and never travel to ATMs alone. Be in your car with your doors locked. Now, Kate says that that money was for, for his rent and to pay for laundry. He says now he doesn't know what he's going to do. Meanwhile, LRPD says if you have any information to contact them directly. Reporting live tonight in Little Rock, Alexis Wainwright, Fox 16 News.